up, Han Ben? You inspecting that? You inspecting that? Yeah? <laughs> That's a big box, huh? That's a big box. Oh my goodness, what's in it? What's in it? Oh. Sorry, baby. What's in it? Will you get to lay on it? I'm sorry, I know it got the uh, light in your face. Oh, <laughs> you gonna? You gotta climb on it? No? You were? Alright. Good girl. If I turn the torch off, will you uh, smile? <laughs> That's so sweet. Hi, hi. It's the tiny one slash Bishi. I'm very sleepy. It is 11.30 at night on November 4th. And a package that I've been wanting to uh, purchase has arrived. I just, up until this point, haven't been able to purchase it, even though I've been wanting to. But I'm very happy I finally did. And you'll see why in a moment. I have all my info on the other side, so it's fine. I should probably shouldn't be doing this while like super sleepy, but well. away from yourself and you toward yourself. Ooh, is it gonna just oh. <laughs> that's so funny. They post it not post it, but they pack it in this. Doesn't need to be packed in all this. Too tired to come back one day. Anymore. Oh, there's a litter box in here. Okay. Okay. Alrighty. So here's a smaller box. That's so funny that they packed in this many blocks. But whatever. Now, I'll let you know right now that it seems currently like I'm spending a lot of money, but I'm not. I'm, even though I'm buying things, it's things I've needed to buy. And I'm still on the lookout for deals. It's not like I'm just. Ooh, money bags and just like going gung ho on everything. So don't you worry about that. Ooh, okay. Just in case some glass. So this oh my god, what the, do they vacuum seal this? I think this is vacuum sealed. If, look at this. Look at this. Oh my god. That's the funniest thing. And then, I bet you, the moment I open this, it just goes all over the place. Actually, I have drinks over here. I don't want to open this uh, so close to my computer, so I'm going to mix. Hold on one second. Okay, now, how do you even open this? There's like no instructions, just... Oh, 
Oh, yeah. <laughs> it is back in the <laughs> going to roll it out all the way but this is my new comforter <laughs> actually it's a duvet insert uh, if you remember my uh, what is it when lady crocodile got me the uh, the big uh, cover with the cat face and the pillows and all that Come to find out, that's a duvet cover, not a sheet like I originally thought. I think I said that in the video later on. Um, but yeah, so finally I got a comforter so that, or an insert so I can put into there and then place it on my bed. The only issue... God, this smells. I, I need to air this out. <laughs> um, I'm not going to wash it though since I'm already going to put it in the duvet. And, and the cover and I already washed the cover now all I have to do is wash my sheets which I got quarters for and then sorry I'm trying to talk over my roommates and then I will show you all the finished product but oh my god this oh it smells like chemicals but the thing that I like it's really soft um how thin is it let me see uh, it's okay. Sorry, that'd be a great, uh, <laughs> a great little, was it like a little screen cap, a little thumbnail. Sorry, you can see. So yeah, so oh my goodness, I'm so happy I finally got this. Uh, it took a while because I had to purchase it for a queen bed, and even if it's a duvet cover or duvet insert. Uh, they're still going to be on the pricey side. Uh, I was able to get this for actually $20. I just needed the basic white. You know, it's going to be all tucked up into the cover anyway. Nobody's going to see it. People are more likely going to see the sheets than anything else, which is why I got the sheets in blue, which will match the background of the cat's face and all that stuff so <laughs> let's wash these i'm gonna wash these and then we're gonna put this all together okay welcome back to i forget which part this is but finally i have the energy cats are off the bed and this is the current state of the bed. I know it's a mess, but basically it's because what happens is, as you can tell, when I get out of bed, I slide to one side and it just drags all the sheets and all that stuff to that side. Uh, so I managed to finally clear up all the bed. And in doing so, I have found the flower if you remember the flower that uh, the little rose that I had made for me for the balloon maker over at Fanime, found it. <laughs> That's what it looks like now. But yeah, okay. So, dead rose. And this is all going to change. Let's first start by putting the sheets on. Ooh, and the fitted sheet is on. I had to struggle with it a little because I'm a little tight person. This is a queen size bed, but got it on. That was the hardest part. And well, I don't know. This may be the second hardest part. It may be putting the duvet cover on, <laughs> but we'll see. Okay, next is the pillows and the sheet. So it looks like I have a little helper. Hello. 
Are you helping? Kitty. Are you helping? Or no? Baby. Oh, this is going to take longer than I thought. And now that my helper's gone, this is what we have left. Yeah, it's a bit wrinkly because I don't know how to fold sheets. And I don't know how to fold the uh, bitted sheets. And the thing is, I'm this one little teeny tiny person. So, yeah, it's going to be wrinkly. And if you're a teeny person like me, who is four seven, and you know how to fold a fitted sheet or a regular sheet perfectly, then you are kudos. Kudos to you. All right, now let's see how hard it's going to be to fit the duvet into the duvet cover. So here's the duvet, and I don't know if you remember, but remember how I said stunk? coming out of that package well I took it and I hung it um, along the top of our back patio door and it stayed that way for weeks weeks maybe a week or two I I don't know what it is it's the what day is today it's the 26th. So, yeah. But now I'm going to attempt to put this in the cover. Wish me luck. So, after fighting with this for, I think, about an hour, <laughs> I was fighting for this way too long. Uh, it's in somewhat. I know it's lumpy in spots, and it's weird in other spots, but it is finally on, and yeah, if I'm able to fix it in the future, I'll fix it. Until then, I'm just, this is as good as it's going to get for a little tiny me. Doing it by myself, right now, energy, and it still has to work in the morning. Well, not in the morning, but tomorrow. But yeah, also, yeah, I know there's wrinkles because, remember, I was a dada and originally used this as a sheet. Didn't realize it was a duvet cover. Never had a duvet cover before. So this was an experience. But yeah, okay. Now I'm going to go ahead and finish this up by putting some of the stuff that I have in my bed back. Not all the stuff. Because, like I said, I'm too tired, but that will come in time. At least this is done. Sorry, I had my fan earlier. Don't know if you could hear it, but I was trying to get super warm trying to get this duvet cover on. But first, back on the bed is going to be Growl and my cat face pillow. I'm not doing my snowflake blanket because I'm actually giving that to the junk boy as he prepares to move out of state. Uh, you'll also see that I am also giving him my Hello Kitty blanket, which normally rests down here at the foot of the bed. And that's only because his cat, Honey, has come to love... You have something on your face, girl. His cat, Honey, has come to love that blanket so much and that's the only blanket that she'll go and lay on. So I decided, you know, give her a little piece of home as she uh, tries to adapt to a new place. All right, next. And my bed is slowly coming back together. Cat included. Good girl. You happy? So 
So that's going to be all for now. I am very, very tired. <laughs> As you could probably guess from doing all that. Um, I'm going to put the rest of my bed together. And then go back to relaxing before going to bed. <sighs> Anyways, this I'm glad that this is finally done. And once again, I want to give a big thanks to Lady Crocodile, who was the big inspiration to finally kick me into gear to finally getting my own sheet set and comforter and all that. Uh, because, like I said before, I was borrowing those things from uh, Mom for years and years and years and years. And it was finally time for me to get my own style and have my own style shine through. And I think I finally have accomplished that, even though I tried to doing that bits and pieces here and there. But no, this is finally, finally it. Also, if you're wondering about the hat, yes, it says Bah Humbug. This is my Bah Humbug hat. It will be close enough to Thanksgiving or after Thanksgiving. By the time you see this video, which I'm still really little warm. Oh, so. So, this won't be an issue as it is at work. I'm already wearing a uh, holiday, a holiday themed hat with, well, I used to have a necklace that blinked and all that stuff, but uh, that broke, unfortunately. Uh, but I do have a little candy cane themed, not themed, rimmed, framed, not rimmed, ugh, that sounds gross, framed uh, name tag. So we're already getting into the holiday spirit at work, and it's going to be vlogmas pretty soon on this channel. Uh, I am hoping to get the tea set once again from 2T, and I'm going to try some teas again. I'm going to do some videos where I talk about stuff, and it's going to be fun. Uh, last year I was able to do it every single day. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it every single day. I will at least try and Instagram a photo trying the tea once a day um, on my Instagram, um, Kitty Lover Roberts. So if you haven't joined, if you haven't followed that, go ahead and go follow. Uh, I think my latest photo that I have up there to date is me with my good guy doll. Anyways, I'm going to go cool down, leisurely put the rest of this bed back together, and that's it. Anyways, thanks so much again for watching. Please stay safe, stay happy, especially this holiday season. Especially Thanksgiving, because from what I've been hearing, it's supposed to be a mess. And I'll talk to y'all later. If this goes up after Thanksgiving... Hope you have a thank happy Thanksgiving. I was gonna say, hope you have a thanks Thanksgiving. That's not a phrase. Anyways, <sighs> too tired. Bye.